Tokyo Banana. All right, Joe, so uh, you've been to Singapore, but you also went to Tokyo. I went to Tokyo, and I wanted to bring back some tastes and flavors of Tokyo when I was over there. And uh, I came across this, Tokyo Banana. Um, so what was interesting is like I found like um, over there they had like a lot of like banana snacks and then they also had a lot of crepes and then this looked kind of like maybe it was like a banana crepe. I'm not like a hybrid. Like a hybrid of it. Yes. So and I bought this. Uh, there you go. And oh, and, and, and your wife has already dug into this. I see. Yeah. So you haven't tried these yet. Uh, I don't believe so. Okay, I might have well, tried one, but I don't remember how it tastes. So I. I, I <laughs> I, I blocked, I psychologically blocked out of my mind so I could bring oh, right, it to yeah, you yeah, first hand. Yeah. Well, there you go, yeah, yeah so for, for Joe, everything, everything's new, every day, everything's new. <laughs> so, yeah, so we, uh, we got it individually packed. You can see it's like, uh, kind of like a little, um, a little thing. Oh, and it's got like a little thing here to kind of keep it fresh. Yeah, and then, it um, says, it says, from Tokyo to all over the country since 1991. There you go. Yeah, we were live in 1991 though. We are practically dinosaurs at this point. That's true, that's On true. YouTube we are. <laughs> Anyhow, um, let's try one. Let's try one. Uh, Alright. So, I put these in the fridge to kind of give it like a little extra special uh, Something. fridge flavor. So, fridge flavor. To make it cool, like that's what I mean, you know. Like yeah, fridge cool. flavor, yeah. Fridge oh, that fridge flavor, yeah, that's it. <laughs> You're licking the inside of your refrigerator. <laughs> Look at that fridge flavor in there. Oh, okay, yeah, there you go, so there you go. It uh, feels kind of spongy on the outside. It's very soft. It's very soft. It's very soft and spongy. Uh, kind of like a, like a sponge cake. <laughs> okay, all right, ready? Right, right. Two. Cheers. Oh my god. Sweet, but not too sweet and very, very smooth. That's the inside of it right there. It's pretty damn smooth. Mm. It's pretty good. Wow, this is fantastic. It's good. So it's basically a, um, it's like a, I guess a, it's like a mush banana. And then no. uh, it's inside, oh, it's like a little brown area. I don't know. Um, I know, but I, I don't know if that's like a maybe it's a little very, extra It's very smooth. It goes down very smooth. It's not too sweet. I thought it was going to be really sweet, but no. some banana folks are super sweet. Mm. But this is very very good. No, it's good. It's like it's like no added sugar like uh, mm. taste anyway. You know where we haven't been yet? We haven't been in North Korea yet. I don't know. We've been in North Korea. No, Dennis Rodman went to North Korea though. He went to North Korea. Yeah, yeah. What would happen if like I somehow raised like 20,000 signatures, got to President Obama and we're like, "Hey, we want Joe to go to North Korea." Would you go? Yeah, I'd go. I could check it out. And would you go meet Kim Jong Un? If you'd meet me. What if, okay, the whole of America is hanging on like everything that you do. You can't, you can't, you can't embarrass America or anything because you know he has, he's like nuts. Mm. So um, what if like you were like, okay, I'm here to represent America in front of Kim Jong Un, and you walk into his palace or whatever he's got down there, and he's like, oh, and the servants are like, he's that way, and then you enter the room, and there's a big jacuzzi, and Kim Jong Un's naked inside it with like 1991 battleships, and he's like, Fiorello, come join me in the water. Would you do it? For America? Would you be like, America! And like just strip down and get in there? Is the water hot? <laughs> is it like a hot tub? Or like That's a, a very interesting question. It's, it's a bit of a jacuzzi, yeah. Would you get in okay. it? Would you like play, play battleship with him? Is it just like a, like a hot springs type thing? Or like just a no, regular no, jacuzzi? No, uh, no, it's a regular jacuzzi, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, okay. Yeah. Because I did go to hot springs in Japan. Oh, okay. There you I go. went like, uh, I took a train from Tokyo to Nagano about an hour, and then an hour outside, another train outside of uh, Nagano. And I took these hot springs, and you go into public uh, hot springs baths, and there's like these old dudes. They basically strip and down they're like, all the way, <laughs> get in here. and then they, they get in. So I'm like, all right, I gotta do what the Romans do in Japan. And then uh, I strip down, and I put my legs in, and burn my fucking legs. Yeah. <laughs> I literally jumped out of the water. I levitated out of the water. Yeah. I was in so much pain. And I had like all these old timers like, oh, 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 how did you go? Huh? How did you go? I like went like to the ear. And so basically you're, you're, like, you're naked dancing around in a hot spring in Japan. I was like, ah! Are you, are you completely naked? I was completely well. So you're like, ah! Oh, your tackle's out there. And, and yeah, and they basically had like these old timers that would like go there every day. And they were like cracking up. They're having like, you know, a ball just watching like this random white dude dancing around freaking naked with burnt legs at the hot springs. They're you know, like, you know, saying something in Japanese, which, you know, probably was long the lines. Like, oh, idiot. look at you, you know. <laughs> yeah. So, uh, yeah, you know, I, I, to answer your question, okay. Okay. <laughs> <laughs>
<laughs> so you want to grade this thing? Because this was amazing, man. Yeah, we'll grade it. You want to have another one? Oh yeah, sure. I have another one. It was kind of like almost like a Twinkie. Like yes, it's, it's very yes. much like it's very much like a Twinkie. Very That's much true. like a Twinkie, but banana inside instead of like cream. This would this is what I would imagine a banana cream pie kind of tastes like without the cream. Anyway, I'm gonna give it two thumbs up. Two thumbs up, though. I highly recommend it. if you go to Japan. It's the reason that they're around since 1991, and the Twinkie Company is no more. Wow. That's a shame. Oh. So well, Twinkies. So, Joe. Yeah. After your travels to Singapore, uh, or before, you went to Indonesia. Before. I didn't go to Indonesia. <laughs> <laughs> close, I went to Japan, just like a few countries away. <laughs> I didn't say go on there. 